So I get an email from Juan Quintero. It says, hi Leon, big fan. I stumbled across this and I'm bugging out. Really recommend seeing it. Possible video? It's outrageous. Thanks dude, keep the great content coming. Thanks. <laughs> Juan. Now I get quite a few DMs and emails from people with content suggestions and I do generally check them out But it is hard to keep up and more often than not it just doesn't pan out It just isn't content that I think would work well for a video, but occasionally uh, in this case, I'll click on it When it comes to manifesting more wealth and abundance, it's important to keep it light remain open and embrace a positive mindset and my curiosity gets the best of me. Let's uh, take a peek Hello everyone and welcome back to a brand new Dark Souls 3 Let's Play. My name is Leon Lush. <coughs> and, uh, my name is Leon Lush and it's just, I'm so grateful <coughs> to have you here for a few minutes today. <coughs> now the name of this video is Citrine Simple 40 Day Money Ritual. And I really think it's a wonderful fit for me because I love money as much as the next guy, right? And if all I have to do is watch this video and learn a 40 day ritual that's gonna keep some more of that presidential broccoli in my wallet, you best believe I wanna be in the know. When it comes to manifesting more wealth and abundance, it's important to keep it light, remain open, and embrace a positive mindset. Okay, right away, I just wanna say, she seems like a lovely lady and I'm fully on board. The keep it light, remain open, and embrace a positive mindset. I'm 100% with you. We're off to a good start because the power of positive thinking is just, it's, it, it's nothing to joke about. It's real. But what happens when the negative mind chatter begins to take over? How do we shift out of that state fast? Now pay close attention because I'm about to show you how. So follow my lead when the negative thoughts start creeping in. Easy. Reach for your crystal ally citrine to illuminate your mind, body, and spirit with light. Oh, you know, you could you could just grab your crystal ally citrine instead. I mean, whatever whatever works for you. I have my method, she has hers. It's, I don't, whatever. Hi, crystal lovers. My name is Heather Askinosi, founder of Energy Muse and author of Crystal Muse, Everyday Rituals to Tune Into the Real You. And today, it's all about citrine the light maker. So Heather is a YouTuber and author and a bit of a crystal enthusiast, which is self-evident if you watch any of her videos. Uh, and admittedly, I don't have a lot of experience using the power of crystals to help manifest wealth, but that is why we're here, is to learn about this citrine 40-day money ritual. Whenever I think about citrine, this particular story always comes to mind. One day, I was scrolling through our secret crystal lovers community on Facebook. Okay, a little side note here. One thing I've learned in my time online is the telltale sign that someone is a legitimate online entrepreneur is when they have their very own secret Facebook group. You want to learn about the power of crystal healing in my uh, secret online Facebook crystal group? Well, I, you, I hope you got the invite because it's a secret. It's a secret group on Facebook. One day I was scrolling through our secret crystal lovers community on Facebook when a post caught my eye. One day, Nigel was scrolling through his secret dick lovers community on Facebook when a picture of an uncut 10 and a half incher caught his eye. Uh, I, I don't know why I have any subscribers. A member, Becky, had posted all about her crystal journey. She had purchased a citrine point to help her manifest her financial goal of buying a house. Okay. Being newer to using crystals, she said she hadn't really used it until the sudden need for a second vehicle arose. Fair point. This yeah. financial obstacle began to weigh on her and the stress began to build. <sighs> Cars then, aren't cheap. Cars are not cheap. she remembered the citrine point she had bought a little while back. She wrote the intention I will purchase a vehicle hmm. in cash and quickly replenish my savings yep. on a piece of paper yep. and placed it yep. under her point. Powerful. Then she repeated that intention every day for 13 days. 13 days. With repeat, their cash repeat. in hand, they went one day to look at vehicles. 
The first Jeep they looked at was 3,500, and they hated it. Oh, it was rusted and needed a number of repairs. For a car you don't mileage. like? No way. High at miles? At that moment, because they really needed it, they considered buying it due to the price. Hell out Later of in the day, they saw a second Jeep with less miles, okay. in great condition, great condi but with a price tag of $4,500. Oh, After 4, talking with the owner, her husband was able to talk him down to 3,300. <laughs> what? They were able to pay cash, no. avoid the loan, and walk what? away with it that day. In that short period of time, Becky oh, it's was gorgeous. able to pair her Citrine as a visual reminder with her intention to manifest her goal. You mean to tell me that Becky went to a car dealer, found a Jeep for $3,500 that was in her budget, but she didn't really like it, it was a little rusty, kind of high mileage. But then she found another Jeep that was right up her alley, lower miles, but $4,500, a little bit out of the price range, but they talked the dealer down to $3,300, paid it in cash, and walked out with it that day? Are you kidding me? Wait a minute. Hold on, what's the point of the story? Oh, the... Cr what the f does that have to do with a crystal? <laughs> In that short period of time, Becky was able to pair her citrine as a visual reminder with her intention to manifest her goal. Hold on, I'm confused. So like the citrine's just like a visual reminder that she needed to buy a car and she like wrote down her intentions and put the citrine on top to remind her that she needed a car, almost like a to-do list. But I mean, Becky, she still had to work to make the money, right? To pay for the car. And, I mean, it's wonderful that the husband haggled it down from 4,500 to 3,300, but I can't imagine he used a crystal to do that. That's just called haggling. I'm just, so what does the crystal actually do? She said that it helped her to move through the stress and really focus on saving money. All right, so I guess the citrine was kind of like a stress reliever for Becky. You know, kind of like a stress ball or, you know, a glass of wine or a blunt. Or something. I mean, everyone has their ways of coping with stress. I guess if citrine is your way, I just, I thought we were going to, I thought citrine was going to help us make money. I didn't think it was just going to be like helping us relieve stress. Come, give me something here, Heather. What's the deal? They made it happen. And you can too. Hey guys, Becky bought a car. And you can too. You just need the money to afford it. Oh, the citrine crystal? No, that's just like, that's a stress reliever. I don't know what the hell that thing's for, but you know, you just got to work and make the money and be able to afford the car like everyone else in the world. This is genius. Citrine is the ultimate crystal to use when you want to change your mindset surrounding money. Remember, money is energy. And when you gaze at a citrine, it's light yellow golden hue. Huh. No, I, I think it's just like paper, actually. If you're bogged down with a negative mind chatter, you're going to feel less abundant and the energy won't flow effortlessly. Yeah, well, I already told you how to fix that. Are you ready to get rid of that negative money mindset and bring in the wealth? Yes. Program a small piece of citrine with your intention. Okay. And for the next 40 days, carry a piece of citrine in your wallet, oh. purse, or pocket, okay. wherever you keep your money. Let this crystal intermingle with your money and infuse it my... with your intention. Uh, right. Every time you open your wallet or reach into your pocket or purse to pay something, you'll catch a glimpse of the light energy The light of energy citrine. of citrine. Make your Remarkable. payment. And before you put your money away, Say a louder in your head, there is more to come. Over the 40 days, experience uh. yourself opening up to the energy of abundance. Take note of any shifts in your finances and mindset. You're probably thinking, that's it? That's all I have to do? That's actually exactly what I'm thinking. How the heck, how did she know that? But is, is that though all I need to do? Yes. yes! Working with crystals really can be as simple as this. Oh, thank God. Oh, I thought I was gonna have to actually work hard for my money, you know, like standing in a circle for 31 hours. <laughs> but seriously, put Elon Musk on notice because I just snatched this smooth ass stone out of my garden and I'm about to manifest a few bills so I can be the first person to live on Mars. Make sure to join our secret crystal lovers community group on Facebook. Wait, how is it a secret if you're advertising it to your entire audience? I don't, I mean, that just kind of loses the magic for me. I want something like invite only, you know, maybe like a secret knock to get into that Facebook group. But if everyone can join, then I mean, you can keep it at that point. Namaste. Namaste.
Listen, I know there's going to be like a ton of people that are, are big into like the crystals and the energy and the, the power of manifestation and divine healing and all these things. And that's totally fine. I just people get triggered. I'm just making jokes, man. I'm just joking around, having some fun. Heather seems like a lovely lady. I'm sure her community is filled with wonderful people, but some of the things are a little bit of a stretch, right? But who am I? to try and knock it until I rock it, right? I haven't tried to manifest, so I figured before I go further, it would only be right if I gave this money ritual a chance. So I did. And as far as I know, with you know my vast knowledge of crystals, I think this garden stone will probably offer me the same benefit as a pointed citrine. So we're just gonna, we're gonna go ahead with this one, but uh, let's see what the results are. It started with the research. I wanted to give myself the best opportunity for maximum dollar manifestation, so to educate myself was a crucial step. And just then I remembered, sweet mother of mercy, I have a smooth-ass garden stone in the junk drawer just behind me. Magnificent. I could feel the energy coursing through the stone and into the soft flesh of my fingertips. I programmed my intentions into that garden stone like a crystal boss. Next move, check my wallet. Eight dollars? Damn, Leon, you's a broke-ass bitch. Not to worry. Through the power of manifestation and the energy of this garden stone, money had no choice but to find its way home to me. The following day, as I pulled my wallet out of the refrigerator... Wait, how, how the hell did my wallet get in the fridge? Uh, it doesn't matter. Because there was now hundreds of dollars manifested where there was only eight the night before. Time to make it rain. I'm gonna be honest with you, I got a little carried away here. Uh, the, just the feeling of having all that money manifested into my hands, really. It was hard to stop. It was hard to stop my body. In my head, I wanted to stop, but it just, it was so empowering that <laughs> to make it, well, anyways. Okay, I apologize for even joking about this earlier before trying it. Uh, color me surprised. The fact that this so blatantly worked. I mean, just one night in the refrigerator, with this garden stone and a couple of good intentions, it turned eight dollars into three hundred and twenty-eight dollars. Are you fucking? Are you kidding me? Imagine what like a week in the freezer with the garden stone would do. That'd be like six, seven grand at least. I just can't. I am so. Oh my. Yellow sapphire is far better than citrine. Look out, guys. We got a crystal snob in the comments here. What about some of us who keep money straight in pockets of the trousers and not in wallets? <laughs> Imagine watching this whole video and that being your number one question. That's incredible. Great, but what if you have no money to save? Oh, no worries, Tracy. The citrine will take care of that for you. Don't even worry about working hard or any of that nonsense. Just, just the citrine. You'll be fine. I am abundance! That's the spirit. <laughs> All right, I'm sorry if I've offended any of you crystal lovers out there. That wasn't my intention. And honestly, in theory... You're going to be having the last laugh when you're sitting on your throne made of diamonds in your manifested palace eating pig's feet covered in foie gras butter, and I'm still over here stuffed in this little office making very mediocre YouTube videos. Joke's on me. To everyone else, thank you so much for watching. I truly do appreciate your time. If you're new here, if you'd subscribe, that would mean the world to me. And if you've been around for a while uh, and you want to take our relationship to the next level, you can maybe buy some merch because everything right now is 35% off. For the rest of December at tomatomafia.com or you can go below this video and there'll be some pictures of the merch down there. You can cop this new piece I'm wearing right here. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. This isn't my merch. My merch is not nearly as cool as this shirt. But it's still pretty cool. It's still pretty cool and it's 35% it's off. So you should buy that merch. Buy that. If you leave a comment down below, that would be wonderful. And before you go, if you could just grab yourself a nice pointed piece of citrine and manifest that right into your rear end and then hip thrust that motherfucking like button for me, I would I would be in your debt. I'll thank you so much and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye. <laughs>